hopes of ramping up the area's vaccination rates. Nueces County Judge Barbara Canales has announced a new campaign. Why should you get the vaccine? Why is it important to you and your family? I want everybody to make an informed decision. I don't want to push a decision on you, but I want you to make a good decision based upon the facts. The Why campaign set to launch next week. It's meant to provide information to those who may still be hesitant on getting vaccinated. Canales says keeping the community informed is crucial. Residents need to know about the Delta variant and how the current vaccine doesn't fully protect you from the virus. However, it does lower your risk of being hospitalized. What about herd immunity? That's when enough people are protected because they've either already gotten the virus or have been fully vaccinated. We've been told 70 to 80% of the population needs to be vaccinated to achieve herd immunity. But as the virus changes, so does that threshold. As the virus is twice as contagious, you need a higher level of immunity in order to create herd immunity. So I think 90% is a reasonable guess. Health experts say with herd immunity, it's all or nothing. Places with higher vaccination rates will see fewer cases than those with lower rates. Governor Greg has already said he will not impose another mask mandate. And the reasons for that are very clear, and that is uh, there are so many people uh, who have immunities uh, to COVID, whether it be through the vaccination, whether it be through their own exposure and their recovery from it, uh, which would be acquired immunity. Uh, and that is it would be inappropriate to require people who already have immunity to uh, wear a mask. Instead of a mask mandate, Governor Abbott says he's working with local officials to make sure they have supplies needed to vaccinate more residents. Now, President Joe Biden, on the other hand, says some kids may need to mask up when they return to school this year. He says the CDC will likely soon advise unvaccinated kids under the age of 12 wear masks at school. Currently, there is no COVID vaccine that's approved for kids under 12. The president saying vaccinated kids over the age of 12 should be okay to return to class without a mask.